Hey everyone, welcome to my Let's Play of Nuclear Throne. This game has several characters to play as. It's a kind of a top-down shooter. It's very action-oriented. It's also kind of a roguelite, similar to Risk of Rain. Kind of bought these two games at like the same time. So I decided, hey, might as well play them on and like share my experience with them. So yeah, we're gonna go through the classes here. I've played a little bit of this game, I've played about three or four hours, so I kinda know how the classes work. We're gonna start with Fish. So his special ability is, I guess he gets more ammo and he has a dodge roll, which unfortunately is not that good. All right, so yeah, it just kind of throws you in and you just kind of gotta kill everything and then move on to the next level. It's pretty simple. So you start out with a basic revolver you can open these red chests, grab some other weapons. Slugger is like a better revolver. I mean, it shoots slugs, so it's kind of powerful as hell. Those little green pellets are experience, so you want to get as much of that as possible to level up. It's pretty basic. It's a very simple but very fun game. Grenade launcher is a much better weapon than the slugger, in my opinion. These first few levels are extremely easy. I mean, it doesn't really get much easier. So after you level up, you can you can like choose between four uh, upgrades here. So let's see. Don't really have any energy weapons. That doesn't seem very good. I think I want to go with extra speed. I'm not sure if that's a good choice, but. We'll just assume it is. And there's Big Bandit, the first boss. And I'm taking a lot of damage and I'm dead, so... Yeah, let's try again there. It's kind of in a tough position at that point, but hopefully this time... We can get a bit further. That was pretty terrible. It's not looking good. <laughs> okay, at least this time we leveled up after the first level, so I mean that's better than last time. Alright. Uh, I guess we'll go with Boiling Bands. It's a little bit useful, not really though. Oh man, I am just running at the bullets here. It's probably a bad idea. Let's stick with the uh, revolver and crossbow. Laser pistol is pretty good, but crossbow is probably better. got another level here. Let's see. More HP for medkits. Always a good choice. Hmm. These things need to die. <laughs> they shoot way too many bullets. Oh my gosh. My dodging skills are not very good right now. Big Bandit goes down pretty quick to crossbow bolts. Alright, let's find the rest of these guys here. A whole bunch of maggots over here. Oh, God, I am just really... Alright. Now we're down in the sewer area. Which is uh, pretty scary. So these motherfuckers. Ooh. Oh, 
Oh, that guy was hiding. Alright. Yeah, these rats have a lot more health than you might think. They're pretty tanky. Oh man, couldn't see what's in that. Rhino skin is always a good choice. More HP in this game is a must. Gotta be careful of those melee guys. Talk to bow. Probably a good weapon, but I'm kind of afraid of it, honestly. Very easy to kill yourself, I think. I haven't really used it very much. That guy is scary. Let's just mow him down. Don't want to deal with those guys. I kind of hide. If you might, you might notice that. Ooh, I thought that guy was dead. Alright, let's get out of here. Didn't level up, unfortunately. Okay. Sometimes you kind of got to stay back and... Make sure you make the, the coast clear here. These guys are weird as hell. I have no idea what they are. They're like future police. I don't even know. But they're very scary. And if you kill that, he'll sometimes open a portal. It's, I thought I'm opening a portal a few times. It's very strange. These guys are weird. I have no idea. Alright. Let's see here. Slower enemy bullet sounds pretty good. Definitely not going to end well. <laughs> All right, let's try again here. Runs in this game usually don't last too long. So you can kind of do several. Machine gun is pretty much just a straight upgrade from the revolver. I mean, pretty much just full auto version of it. Didn't level up in the first level, it sucks. Probably some enemies back there. Alright. I don't know, the SMG has a lot of spread. It's not too good. I don't really like the shotguns in this game. Is that it? Nope. I haven't really used the special ability at all just because it's really wonky. Like, it's hard to control. Because you kind of bounce off walls gets me more trouble than it's really worth. Maybe if I learn to use it better, it might become something valuable, but right now it's not really too good for me. Oh, I walked right into that, didn't I? Enemy HP. Sounds good. This MG is pretty good against these guys. Tight corridors and whatnot. Ow. 
now. Oh, that guy had a shotgun. I'm gonna go with the disc gun. It's really dangerous, but I kind of like using it. Uh, we're gonna go with more maximum ammo. Uh, that was a terrible time to use that. Funny how just after I was saying it's dangerous to use, because if it bounces back, it actually just kills you outright, so you really gotta be careful with it. But obviously it can be very useful. Kind of bounce around and kill enemies for you. It's annoying when you don't switch when you think you did. Ah oh man, a minigun. It's not really going to help me here. I will keep it though, just because I'm crazy. Whoa, I thought. <laughs> Gotta be careful. Alright, come here, bird. Is that it? No. Wow. Terrible damage. Holy fuck. Bolts? I don't need bolts. Oh no, uh, this gun uses bolts. Not discs, which is interesting, but whatever. Oh my god, they can attack very far. I thought they were melee, yo. Looks like uh, they have a decent range. Much more than I thought. I'm really not getting far. Which is quite bad. Sledgehammer, meh. Saves ammo, I guess, but who really cares about that? Sometimes it gets kind of important. I'm gonna stick with the revolver just cause <laughs> uses the SMG a lot. Alright. Uh more max ammo, I guess. Some of the upgrades are just not very good. Really gotta just get the one that's the least bad. Like sometimes they're just all really bad. Alright. Ooh, that was terrible. Yeah, killing the big bandit with only a pistol is kind of a bad idea. But I still jammed him, so. It was worth it in the end. Ooh, grenade launcher. Much better. Probably should have just sledgehammered that thing, but whatever. Okay. More HP for med kits. We're gonna go with that. Alright. Kind of getting myself into a corner there. Low HP. Wonderful. Whoa. Lots of rats. I need to get that big rat. Oh my god. Fucking terrible.
I'm obviously not very good with fish. Just because of the ability, I'm, I'm just not using it as well as I probably should be. I'm very good with a uh, robot. I use this ability decently effectively, but it's pretty easy <laughs> ability to make use of. He kind of just recycles weapons and turns them into ammo or health. Ugh, I'm just taking silly damage. Eh, slugger, whatever. Alright. Not getting a rabbit paw, which is it's an incredibly good ability. I mean, uh, upgrade. I'd really like to have it. Just kind of using all my laser rifle or laser pistol because, uh, Gonna pick up the grenade launcher, so. Oh, switch. <laughs> Alright, good. Oh, that's a good ability. More attract power. Always useful. I'm not sure if you can hear my cat sneezing in the background. <laughs> uh, no, we'll stick revolver, I guess. Alright. That's it? Okay. Is there anything down here? No. Let's get out of here. <laughs> that was weird. Uh, okay, might as well go with that. I don't know, still using revolver by this point is pretty bad. Did I level up? No, I didn't. Alright. Whoa. Oh, I did get rid of the, uh... <laughs> yeah, going out is probably not a good idea. Alright. Wait a second. Alright, let's uh, try again here. I'm gonna use the same character. Alright, let's actually try to get somewhere this time. As in... Past Big Dog, which is the second boss of the game. Lost. We'll try it.
We saw a rifle, that's good. Oops. <laughs> we'll just get both the uh, regenerating stuff. Triple machine gun, that's quite good. But it does kind of uh, get rid of ammo very quickly, so you gotta be careful about that. Oh, maggot thing over here. Maggot nest of some sort, I don't know. Alright. Oh, that's wonderful. Alright. I do like the spread of this <laughs> triple machine gun. It's pretty sick. Alright, just a normal shotgun. Not interested. Although I should be trying to get ammo. Plasma gun? I don't think I've ever really used this very much. I'll give it a try though. Damn, there's some ammo back there. Hmm. Full health and some ammo. I kind of really need ammo, so I'm gonna go with it. Yeah, there we go. That's good. Turned out to help quite a bit. I kind of needed that. Wow. Big explosions. Oops. Let's see if we can get rid of that car. Whoa. Those melee guys. Very scary. That's kind of cool. It has some sort of AoE effect. The plasma gun does. I kind of really like the uh, triple machine gun here, so I'm going to stick with it. <clears throat> Ooh, that last guy. No, oh, nope. I guess it wasn't the last guy. Oh, shit. Okay, good. <laughs> Always scared of those guys. Rhino skin. Wonderful. Almost seemed like the plasma gun didn't have. Oh my gosh. Didn't have a very good range, but. I think I might have just hit something by accident. You gotta keep moving so those future police don't really <laughs> get ya. The screwdriver. Wonderful. Not something I need. Oh my gosh. Don't stand in the fire. Not a good idea. Hmm, okay. Alright, let's fight big dog here. And we got him, barely. Ah, and we died to the fire, oh my gosh. That sucks. Alright, last run. Hopefully. Hopefully last one, unless I die really fast. Oh my gosh, that was very disappointing. I did not notice the fire there. Well, got a crossbow, so that's good. Plutonium hunger or whatever. Alright. Nope. Bunch of melee weapons. I 
don't know, Ult's roll seems to do is just make me go faster. Like, that's how I use it right now. I feel like if I try to dodge with it, I'll just end up running into more bullets. Especially the fact that you kind of bounce off walls like that, see? It's a bit silly, but whatever. Take that guy out really quick. Crossbow. Always a good weapon choice. Definitely want to use the crossbow on these guys if you can. Alright, sweet. Uh, I guess we'll go with Bloodlust. <laughs> kind of shot him and he turned around. Whoa. Yeah, those guys have shotguns. Well, that's, it's trying to give me health. <laughs> But I'm already at max health, so it's not really working for it. Oh, this is a very bad fighting spot against one of these. Okay, good. Lots of bolts, so let's use those. Whoa. Need to find a new weapon. Definitely don't want to bring the revolver into the next area. Unfortunately, I may have to. Oh, maybe not though. Sweet. Assault rifle, okay. I think I'm gonna go with boiling veins, honestly. Just because of the fire in this area. Kind of seemed to get me a lot. Oop, melee guy. They try to hide. They're pretty tricky. Ah, the fire again. Uh, we're gonna stick with what we got. No, I might switch actually. <laughs> Kinda running low on ammo. I don't know. These two very uh, precise weapons. To call a grenade launcher precise is kind of weird, but you know you got to use it carefully. But two very powerful weapons. Oh my gosh, those guys are so scary. Another one. Whoa. Oh my gosh. A disc gun, I don't really want that. I already have some very dangerous weaponry on me. The grenade launcher. Are we good? Some more over here. Sweet health. Okay. Rhino skin. Always a good choice. Oh, that guy needs to die. Okay. Oh my gosh. Mm. 
Okay, good. Big dog is down there. Seems to be hurting himself. Uh... Yeah, he's kind of doing the work for me. This is a very good position against Big Dog. Oh, that's not good. Ignore. Uh, ignore. This is bad. It seems like the portal is trying to open over Big Dog's head. Very interesting. Hmm. Well, I guess that'll do it. That is my background. It's a, uh, you could have thrown background there, so that's cool. Anyway, that's a very interesting way to end the first episode. Try not to let that happen to yourself. Anyway, I'll see you guys later.